Today we have one movement, it's going to take you no more than five minutes and it's going to massively help you improve your footwork and rotation in the golf swing. So let's get to work. This is the counter switch rotation. And it's going to help you all the way through your swing to move better and create more speed. So as we look at the golf swing, we need to be grounded, we need to be able to react and create pressure through the ground. Everyone's talking about Scotty Scheffler, his footwork is effective, okay, and that's what you're going to build here because as we load down, we're then pressuring the ground, we change direction and we work a long range of motion. That's huge for your rotation and it all comes from the ground, okay. So in terms of executing this movement, we're going to work both sides but the first part is to go into a counter rotation. Basically, we're going to slacken the band, okay, so rotate the hips just enough. It's only a small movement. You'll see all of the longest plays in the world, someone like Kyle Berkshire doing this. The counter movement allows you to then react and go in the opposing direction. That's what we're working right now. So we work down and loosen the band. We then press and pull to work across the system. Okay, you can do this as fast as you want to develop over time. Okay, so we loosen and then rotate. And that vertical lengthening is huge for your swing. All right, looking at the backswing first, as you turn into that position, we want to feel as though we get longer in the trail side. We want to get nice and tall, so we load and rotate. And at the top of this position, you can see we're in a really good shoulder tilt. We've got the trail hip rotated and we've got pressure into that trail foot. Okay, the big muscles are loading, we've created more speed, we've used the ground to do it, and we've got that rotation around the spine. Looking at it down the line, you can see how we create all of the positions we need in the swing. And we can do so with speed and consistency through that movement pattern, okay? As we then take it more into impact, you're going to see more clear benefits here, okay? So we stay in our posture, we've already worked the backswing side, now we're going to go to the lead side, exactly the same execution. So we loosen, then we extend, rotate and pull. And you think about hitting those long high drives, you want the lead hip to post and push out of the ground, rotate and clear, and then the lead shoulder is going to clear as well, okay? The more stacked we are, the higher the launch, the longer the hit, okay? So you can work this with absolute speed, you can feel as though you push and clear that lead side out of the way to make sure you've got massive speed into the ball as well as those vertical forces, okay? And that's why we're talking about footwork and rotation together because if you just rotate, we really don't have too much going on. But if we then add the lateral and the vertical, you get the power trifecta, okay? And if you think about this as you execute the shot, if we can be in our backswing and then we push, load, rotate and clear with maximal speed, We've got incredible mechanics to then take it to the course and develop a much better motion. Okay, and that's what this is all about. This is a great drill before you go and play. It's going to get you warm. It's going to get you loose. It's also going to get your swing mechanics on point. Because if you can start to execute this with huge confidence, just a few times a week, you're going to feel how the feet work, how to rotate the hips, how to create height and rotation around the spine, and then deliver it consistently, okay? One more time, we loosen, stretch, and rotate. It's an incredible movement, it's going to add more speed through the whole body, it's gonna activate the big muscles, and it's gonna create you a better rotational pattern around the spine. That means better ball striking, more speed, but also less injuries because you're understanding how the body wants to work and removing so many of those poor rotational patterns that golfers have out on the course. Okay, so do this with a light band, build up over time, increase speed, increase rotation, and make your golf swing far more durable so that you can golf strong when you get out on the course. Okay, and if you want more of this, head over right now, get the Driven Golf and Fitness app for on-demand workouts, mobility drills, practice sessions, and more, so you can always be working on body and game to be at your best on and off the course. And if you like this video, make sure you hit like, hit subscribe, tell your friends, and then join the strongest movement in golf.